children it's lesson time it's going to be an exciting time for you not just for this week but year long we are going to learn about the topic god loves you in grade 1 under this topic we are going to learn of how god created this beautiful world just because he loves us and how he has given us a beautiful family and how he wants to protect us provide for us and above all how he wants to forgive us so we're going to learn about all this beautiful exciting topics this year long so please do not miss any week but join us every sunday at 5 pm this year to learn about this topic god bless you hi good evening children i hope you are all happy healthy and have you been enjoying all the stories memory verses and activity sheets yes all right i am glad that you are enjoying the stories and everything that is being given by god through way bible school children today we are going to learn a story that happened after israel people crossed the red sea our lesson's name is mara's water sweetened mara's water sweetened mara is a place and how and why the water got sweetened there is about today's story okay children israel people after crossing the red sea they entered a desert called shur shur now desert means they will not have any food to eat nor water to drink they were all very thirsty tired of walking so long they searched everywhere they could not find water if you are thirsty what you would do you will go simply fetch water and drink if you don't have water to drink you will either ask your friends or you might purchase water okay let's imagine that you are in the desert and you don't have water to drink what you would do yes you will pray to god right let us see what happened in this situation now israel people children animals like camels donkeys men women everyone were so thirsty they could not go any step further and finally they got a small pool of water everyone went with so much of joy hope to drink that water but the moment they tasted it they spat that water you know why because the waters are bitter there that place name is called mara mara means bitter mara means what bitter now they started complaining to moses Moses it is because of you that we came all the way from Egypt back in Egypt we had good food we had good water to drink but here in the desert from 3 days we do not have any water and now we found some water which is so bitter now Moses did not complain to God Moses prayed and cried out to God God please help us in this situation. Now God spoke to Moses. Moses, look, look at that wooden log. Take it and throw that log into the water. Without doubt, Moses did exactly how God instructed him to do. The moment wooden log was thrown into the water, all the Mara's water, the bitter water became sweet water. Now children men women donkeys camels everyone is satisfied when they drank water from mara children similarly whenever you come across a difficult situation in your life do not complain don't complain to god don't complain about your mom and dad don't complain about teachers elders your friends anyone just pray to god and if it is with the people around you try to solve the problem by talking to them okay it helps us to have a very good behavior towards people and it helps us to be faithful towards god okay if we decide to do so close your eyes let us pray and ask god to help us okay close your eyes children 
dear heavenly father lord thank you so much for turning mara's bitter water into sweet now we know that you can turn any bad situation in our lives into a good situation we completely trust you lord help us to never complain about your plans in our lives help us to not complain against our parents teachers elders friends and everyone around us help us to be compassionate and lord help us to honor you and to thank you in everything we do help us to rely on you o oh master we love you a lot in jesus most precious name we ask and receive amen children please open your memory verse it is from the book of psalms 107 chapter 107th chapter 9th verse okay he satisfies the thirsty and fills the hunger hungry with good things okay now i have few questions for you now that you have heard the lesson i have few questions for you four okay i'll ask you them mara means what children mara means what mara means bitter correct second one god told moses to throw what in the mara's river in mara's water a wooden log a wooden log third one what happened to the water after throwing that log bitter water turned into sweet yes one question i have what did we what did you learn from this story children we learned that we should god we should ask god for our needs and never to complain never to grumble okay children keep this story always in your mind okay and if you come across or if you find your friends or families or relatives going through these situations tell them don't complain because god does not like it thank god and ask god definitely god meets all our needs you are going to say that okay all right children take care of yourselves and please download your activity sheets from the given link take care and god bless you bye children